Hey guys, welcome to a new video from Masters of Consulting. I hope you are all keeping safe in these difficult times. In this video, I am going to give a quick update on coronavirus situation in Germany and share my experience with the COVID test I took today in Munich. The situation in Europe has been worsening for the past few weeks. Countries like France, Spain and UK are already in the state of yeah, kind of emergency. The number of cases in Germany yesterday were highest since the start of pandemic. Experts say that this could be also due to the heavy testing that is being done. Yeah, Germany actually it's testing, they are testing a lot in Germany these days. That's also true that in Germany you can take a COVID test with ease. So as I'm flying to India in the month of November, I've decided to try and take a test and see how it is done. First, we have to book an appointment online. I will add the link in the description below. This is only for the people who are in Munich. So either you can go in by car, by walk or by bicycle. I would recommend going in by car as I feel it is much safer than to walk in or by bicycle. So on Monday this week, I have decided to take the test and I could already book the appointment for Friday which is actually not that bad when you see the whole situation as it is safer to drive in rather than to walk or by going or going by bicycle I've decided to choose the option of driving in so you get an email after your booking is confirmed with the details of the location which includes the street name the date the timing and finally a booking code which you have to provide it at the time of the test so my appointment was at 11:40 a.m. and I reached the location at 11:35 a.m. I've seen that there were a lot of cars waiting in the line already. So there was a guy in the front wearing a green jacket who was checking for the names if they've been registered. If you are registered, he will let you in. So once I got in there, there were two lines for the cars. One is for the ones who have been sent by the Gesundheitsamt, which translates as health authorities in English. And the other line was for people like me who want to just do the test to know if they are positive or not. There was another guy who is checking if we have an appointment or we have been sent by the health authorities. So after staying in line for 40 to 45 minutes, I reached to the point where they are taking the test. At least that's what I thought. So in the first tent, they verified all my details again. This includes my address, my telephone number, my booking ID and then they gave me two documents out of which I had to give one to the doctors who took my COVID test. This document had details of my health insurance. When I reached the final tent, the doctor has asked me why I am taking this test and I told that it is just for me to know if I am positive or negative for COVID and then he asked me to open my mouth and put the swab in my throat. Actually, it kind of hurt. After that, he gave me another voucher which had the details of online login. I will link this also in the description below. In this link, we can actually check the results and uh, he actually told me that the results will come on Monday. So I took the test on Friday and the results will be coming on Monday, which is not bad. Uh, so this is it. I just came out of the place and then it's all done. So it took me around like one hour from the appointment time to the time it's finished. So this was my experience with the whole Corona test and hopefully this has been helpful for you. I hope this situation subsides very soon. Please stay strong and if you want to do a test, please do it because it is good to know if you're positive or negative for COVID. Especially young people like us, we don't have symptoms most of the time. So it's always good to test as much as possible. And if you test pos for positive, then it is good to stay home and yeah, not go out. Hopefully, I will test negative on Monday. So yeah, stay safe and until next time.